I'm going to show you how to make um, some certificate mock-ups out of scrap paper. So, you may have handy some of your previous mock-ups. They're all the same size. And so, you just position your scrap paper underneath align the corners and then cut off the excess with the paper cutter savage and there that's basically size A4 you don't have any um, mock-ups, previous mock-ups, then take one of the fancy guys line up the corners as best you can. Doesn't have to be exact. And um, cut off the excess. And I've made sure. Um, I like this decal edge type feel. I don't want to cut that off unless I have to. So don't go too far. fancy guy away. And there's your A size, A4 size paper ready to be tested on. And then, of course, because we want to make sure when we do this mock-up, it's facing the right way and we know which way it's going to face. Just, uh, Draw something to let you know the orientation. This is up, and this is down. Okay? I like to draw a chicken. Draw whatever you want. Um, and this way you know you, you want your uh, picture here, your little tiny picture, and you want to feed it into the printer just like that. Sometimes, to save time, I will reuse my mock-ups to make more mock-ups. Because all I really need is the, the, the size of the paper. I need to know it's oriented a certain way. And I want, I'm just checking to make sure the image shows up relatively in this area without covering any text. And sometimes I might make notes on it. For example, I'll say, feed in paper this way with an arrow, right? Usually it's okay, and the printer will accept it without a problem. But sometimes, if there's writing, or any, or even a, a, an image near this edge where you feed it in, when the printer, printer's laser goes to detect the paper edge and the paper thickness, it, it picks up on this, and it, it doesn't like it. <laughs> And it says we can't accept this or it, it says like there's an issue right in that case don't try to work with this page anymore just make a new one or use one where there's no no writing or prints down here this is all very unnecessary if, if you have just nice clean a4 paper but i mean i like to just reuse them because why not saves it saves more paper so that was just an issue you re may run into it's the same issue that comes up for this deckle edged paper 
sometimes it doesn't like that the edge isn't straight so it'll it'll be mad and tell you I can't understand this paper um, actually okay this is facing uh, upside so I would feed it into the printer this way and if it doesn't like this jagged edge I just go here and I go to the, the very edge and I just cut off just enough so that it's a straight edge and the printer is okay with the, the, the edge detection and the, the paper's thickness detection.